Hey everyone, it's Lisa. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make these zucchini squares that my grandma used to make when we were kids. So if you have extra zucchinis coming out of your garden and you don't know what to do with them, stay tuned and I'll tell you how to make this. So to make these zucchini squares, you're going to need three cups of zucchini. I grate them with my cheese grater and then when you're done, you want to make sure you take some paper towels and wring out all the excess water so that they're not so moist. I also like to cut a few pieces at the end, not perfect pieces, but just pieces just to put over the top of my squares to make it look pretty when, I'm, when it's all baked. Uh, you need a half a cup of Parmesan cheese. You need a half a cup of finely chopped onions. You need one cup of Bisquick pancake mix. A fourth of a cup of vegetable oil. We use canola oil. So you need four eggs. We need uh, two tablespoons of parsley and a fourth of a teaspoon of black pepper, a fourth of a teaspoon of oregano, and a dash of garlic powder and a half a teaspoon of salt. So basically all we're gonna do is mix everything together in one big bowl. This is a super easy recipe, but I've gotten a lot of requests for it. And this is a recipe my grandma used to make when we were little. So I um, thought I would show you guys how I make it. Even though it's super simple, I know a lot of people just like to see it done sometimes. There's the cheese, there's the bisquick, I already put the oil in, there's the eggs, the onions, we need a half a teaspoon of salt, a fourth of a teaspoon of pepper, a fourth of a teaspoon of oregano, a dash of garlic powder, and your parsley. So now you're just going to mix everything together until it's all mixed. Okay, now that it's all mixed together, you want to make sure you have your oven preheated to 350. You're going to take your 13 by 9 dish, Pyrex dish, and just put that in there. Okay, and then how I said I keep these extra pieces just for the end to add them. I just like to lay them on the top because it looks pretty when it's all baked. Now you're going to put this in the oven for uh, 30 minutes. I tend to leave it in for 40 minutes because I like it to cook a little more. I like it to get a little golden on top. Um, and then that's it. Okay, so this just came out of the oven. I did do 40 minutes and that's this is exactly how you want it to look. A little golden on top. A little gold on the sides and it looks pretty with all those zucchinis on top so now we're going to cut it up and see how it looks so this is what it looks like all plated up it's like a kishi frittata it's really delicious it's healthy Gemma enjoys it i've been eating it for lunch every day just a square or two and uh, it was super easy to make so if you guys have any questions about this recipe please leave it in the comments below and um, i will see you in my next video thanks a lot